Hi, welcome back to Redline Race Day. Today my track is set up for a speed test. Plus I added a few extra pieces just to change things up a bit. The cars I'm using today, two from the Hot Wheel Club series, which are the TNT Bird and the Heavy Chevy, against two original spoilers, the Chrome King Cuda and the King Cuda. The speed test will determine the racing order for the weeks ahead. Here's the Hot Wheel Club spoilers, TNT Bird. Its color is Spectre Flame Purple. It has a metal body and a metal base, and it's riding on those neoclassic Redline wheels. Next up is the Hot Wheel Club Spoilers Heavy Chevy. Its color, Spectre Flame Red, it has a metal body and a metal base, and it's riding on those neoclassic redline wheels. Here we have the King Cuda. Its color is Spectre Flame Aqua. It has a metal body and a metal base, and it's also riding on those red line wheels. Next up from 1970 is the club kit Chrome King Cuda. It has a metal body and a metal base, and it's riding on those red line wheels. And now it's time for the speed test. Up first, TNT Bird. Its speed, 100 miles per hour. Next up, Heavy Chevy. Its speed, 75 miles per hour. Next up, King Cuda, car number five. Its speed, 95 miles per hour, and unfortunately it crashed at the turn, but the speed still counts. We'll go with that. Last up, we have the Chrome King Cuda. Its speed, 90 miles per hour. Okay, let's give the King Cuda a non-qualifying extra run because it crashed at the corner. Its speed, 100 miles per hour. We'll stick with 95 that it gave us first, just to be fair.
Next week, we'll see race number one, which will consist of the Aqua King Kuda versus the Purple TNT Bird. The following week, we'll see the Heavy Chevy versus the Chrome King Kuda. The winner of race number one and race number two will then advance to the semifinal race. Finally, on week number four, we'll have the championship race. Thanks for joining me on Redline Race Day today. I hope you had a good time. Remember, Hot Wheels goes faster, roll further, and if you like what you saw, why don't you go ahead and click like and subscribe. While you're there, hit that notification bell, because here, you're only going to find the fastest miniature metal cars you've ever seen. I'll see you next race.